Hi, hello, welcome to VS Tool Basics. Today we are going to implement off header using two stone marks. How many two stone marks required to implement the off header? This is most common interview question for pressure and interns actually. First of all, we need to know what is two stone marks. So this is this, this is this simple diagram of two stone marks. I not I one select are the input uh, output uh, uh, Z will be the output. If you see the truth table. If select is 0, I not will be assigned to output is that if select is 1, I1 will be assigned to output is that now uh, we can see the off header. So this is the circuit diagram of off header uh, to calculate the sum A and A X or B will give you the sum A and B will give you the carry. So instead of using uh, XR gate and uh, and gate we need to use uh, max two is one max actually so this is the truth table for uh, off header if you see uh, uh, there are two outputs right so uh, uh, with respect to these two input uh, we need to uh, implement uh, these two outputs actually if you see uh, when a equal to 0 uh, B is directly assigned to sum If a equal to 1, b bar will be assigned to sum. If a equal to 0, carry is equal to a. If a equal to 1, carry is equal to b. So this is how we need to look and understand the truth table first. Then we need to implement the half order using two stone marks. So if you see here, a is 0 B will be assigned to sum if A is 1 B bar will be assigned to sum in case of carry if A is 0 A will be assigned to carry which means 0 will be assigned to carry if A is 1 B will be assigned to carry here if you see you, you will blindly say that uh, we required uh, only two gates uh, two two uh, marks are needed to implement the off header but here if you see not get so to compute b bar we need to have one more uh, two stone marks actually so totally three marks are required to implement the off header now I am going to implement this in Verilog and I will explain with the waveform, simulation waveform. So this is the 2 east 1 max Verilog code. If you see I0, I1 select are the input, Z will be the output of this module. I am using case statement to implement the max. So if select is 0, I0 will be assigned to output Z. If select is 1, I1 will be assigned to output Z. So instead of using uh, XR gate and AND gate to implement the off header, here I am using the two stone marks. To, to get the B bar value, I am using this max. To get the sum, uh, I am using this max. To, to generate the carry, I am using this two stone marks. Okay. So uh, as we discussed in the presentation, uh, so we need to implement an odd gate using a uh, two stone max so uh, uh, so we need to calculate uh, not of b right so we need to uh, tie uh, select to b actually if b is uh, 0 uh, output b bar will uh, become 1 if b is 1 output b bar will uh, become uh, 0 since we tied 1 to i not and 0 to i1 we will uh, implement the not get in this max now moving to the sum portion so here if you see uh, select uh, is tied to a i not is tied to b i1 is tied to b bar as we discussed in the truth table if select uh, a is 0 b will be assigned to sum if select a is 1 means b bar will be assigned to sum now we are getting the sum here now we need to implement the carry 
so for carry we need to implement the and get for and get a will be tied to select as well as i not b will be tied to i1 if select is 0 which means a is 0 that 0 will be assigned to carry if select is 1 whatever present in the b that will be assigned to carry so this is how we are implementing the half header using 3 to east 1 marks moving to the test bench of the half header so here a and b are the input so i am declaring that as register carry and sum are the output so i am declaring that as a wire here i am instantiating the half header marks here in the initial begin i am toggling all the four combination of uh, uh, a and b actually now i will show you the uh, simulation waveform as per the offer truth table if you see uh, if a and b both are zero then carry is g carry also will be zero and uh, sum also zero and uh, if you see if a is zero b is one then sum will be one carry will be zero if a is one b is zero that time also carry is zero sum is one if a and b both are one at that time carry will be one sum will be zero so if you see the max outputs we will understand more so this is the first max where we are implementing the b bar so b has been connected to the select right so if you see this is same as b and if you see the output is the top that particular max that will be inversion of invert of b so in this max we are implementing b bar if you see the sum select is equal to a i naught is equal to b i1 is equal to b bar okay so if select is 0 b will be assigned to output sum if select is 1 b bar will be assigned to output sum that's what we are getting here in case of carry if you see select is connected to a i not also a i1 will be b okay if select is 0 i not also will be 0 then output carry also will be 0 if select is 1 whatever present in the i1 which is nothing but b that will be assigned to carry so this is how we are implementing half header using 3 2 east 1 max thanks for watching this video please like share and subscribe this channel for more videos